When a patient finds out that they've been diagnosed with a brain tumor, their whole world turns upside down. Many of them just feel in shock. Many just can't believe that this is really happening. So my personal philosophy on patient care is that I'm part of this team with them. That's the part I enjoy the most. I enjoy working together with people to really hear what their unique needs are and to really think about uh, the treatment and the caring that we give to get them through. And I think it's important to not only treat my patients for their tumor, but to really think about their quality of life and their life after as cancer survivors. So for my patients, proton therapy means that I can decrease the dose of radiation to normal parts of the brain that are very important. Protons have the unique property of being able to deposit all of its energy once it enters the body, and thus we can stop it where we want to rather than it completely moving through. With proton therapy, since we get less low-dose spray to the rest of the brain, there is a decreased risk of getting secondary tumors many years down the road. The other big benefit of proton therapy is the ability to decrease the risk of short-term memory loss and uh, thought process decline that may happen years down the road. So I'm very interested how our improved technology translates to better outcomes, whether it's quality of life or better cure rates. This is especially important in our children who develop uh, secondary malignancies at a much higher rate. Proton therapy is a huge part of the future of treating kids with cancer. And we have a world-class team with Seattle Children's. We are making fantastic advances in chemotherapy and surgery and radiation. And this is the best way that I know of right now to effectively treat the tumor and spare as much healthy tissue as possible so it has the fewest short-term and long-term side effects. That's crucially important when we treat children because there is no reason why healthy tissue beyond the area where I'm trying to treat should receive radiation. The only reason that the radiation continues to go forward is because with most types of radiation, we can't make it stop. And I think what's particularly gratifying for me, both as a doctor and also as a parent, is knowing that in the future, my patients who are treated with protons will often have fewer long-term side effects. And when we think about treating children, the short-term side effects are absolutely important, but it's those long-term side effects which we really want to minimize. And I think treating with protons allows me to do that for many patients. I am thrilled to have this cutting edge technology here in the Northwest. I've believed in protons enough as a modality of treatment that before we had a proton therapy center, if I felt protons was the best way of treating a patient, I would make arrangements for them to travel to other parts of the country. And that was a tremendous hardship on families. But now when I see families, I can tell them, we can give you the very best treatment and we can do it here in the Northwest.